I also would like to ask you about Ted Cruz, uh, because he's been called a lot of things, quite frankly, a jerk, aggressive, and Mother Jones even called him the Republican Barack Obama. As you know, he survived one of the most expensive primaries in Texas history. So I'm curious your thoughts. Do you think he is perhaps the next great conservative hope, as the National Review recently dubbed him? Well, I think it's certainly too early to judge anyone who's only been in the Senate for four months. Right. But uh, I think he has done what he said he would do in the campaign. Uh, he said he would go in and shake things up, and he's done that. Uh, so I think he is um, you know, yet to be formed completely, right. but he is doing what he said he would do. Well, and on that point, Senator, because you brought it up, he's been positioning himself, it seems, uh, in a way that is leading many to believe he has his eyes already set on the White House. He went to New York to meet with Wall Street bankers, as well as a trip to South Carolina to give a speech. I mean, do you think, given that he's a first-time senator, four months, as you stated, isn't this a bit premature? Um, the moves he's making, as well as all the conversation around it? Or perhaps did Obama himself dispel the notion that a first-time senator can't become president? Well, I was just getting ready to say, Ahmed, um, I think uh, President Obama uh, jumped in when people said, what? <laughs> you know, he was barely in there two years, and he was uh, beginning to run for president, and he certainly uh, jumped in with both feet and ran a campaign that could win. So um, I, I don't, I don't think that uh, the time that he's been in the Senate is necessarily dispositive of um, Ted Cruz's ambitions, but uh, I think people are going to certainly want to know more about what he believes and how he's going to conduct himself. 